welcome back to another video uh, this in this video i'm just uh, going to talk about the best rom for redmi 7 and redmi y3 you guys always keep asking me what is the best rom for redmi 7 and redmi y3 and after trying a lot of rom i just found that rom and this is the best rom according to me and i just want to say that uh, among all the roms available for redmi 7 and redmi y3 uh, in online so you guys can check yourself and this is Moki ROM and this is based on Android 10 and if you are using Android 11 or 12 the, and if, if you guys want a performance ROM and gaming ROM and battery life then you have to sacrifice the Android version then you guys uh, have to downgrade your Android version if you are using Android 11 and 12 because uh, this is Moki ROM and this is based on Android 10 and very latest version has been released and I didn't test that ROM yet so I don't know uh, that one uh, based on Android 10 or 11 maybe that one also based on Android 10 maybe so after testing that one I also make the review so you guys can use that one definitely and blindly you guys can use that room and if you guys after using that room if you guys say uh, that you are not still satisfied then i should i just want to say all of you guys i'm really sorry and uh, because i found that this is the best gaming room and the performance room and also the battery backup is really great in that room i tested everything and I am using that for a long time and you guys can see uh, I am using the Google camera I already posted uh, that Gcam so you guys can check and it's working pretty much fine and this is really a great performance from you guys can go with that my recommendation will be and this is really battery smooth and you guys can see I have installed so many uh, things here and uh, onto the benchmark you guys can see and let me show you the onto the benchmark score and I'm just focusing this from uh, according to gaming so that's why uh, I won't talk about anything extra just basic things I just want to show you guys so this is the gig bench uh, sorry this is the uh, onto the benchmark score so you guys can see everything and which is really great for redmi 7 and I just want to show you some screenshots so you guys can see here I just want to show the recent screenshot that here is that uh, I ran the here you guys can see here the CPU throttling I ran it for five to five minutes so you can see here and the CPU throttle to 84 percent so you guys can get idea and let me show you so here is the Geekbench score and which is surprisingly uh, far better than Android 12 port and Android 11 ROMs you guys can see the one and by default we have some things uh, like here is the Moki and recorder and everything and let me show you status bar here and we have everything working I found here and the network screen cards I can't say about screen cards because I don't have the facilities to check that and reading mode everything working dark mode AOD AOD is working pretty much fine let me show you that so you guys can see it's working pretty much fine and remember this is a vanilla build and you have to flash GFs and I'll drop the GFs link in description and uh, my recommendation will be use that GFs and don't use other GFs and if you have uh, better bit caps then you guys can use otherwise use that one and by default we have that launcher launcher and we have so many customization so much customization you can see you guys can arrange your desktop icon size text size and levels and grid size you guys can check uh, change everything you want and we have plugins here you guys can add plugins here search engine like google and so many uh, available you guys can add so this is really cool isn't it and we have theme colors you guys can add and you guys can uh, uh, change the shape icons see into so many options are available you guys already know about that launcher and i personally prefer that launcher 
uh, over the oxygen waste and any kind of launcher and we had the gesture type you guys can enable touch and hold and double tap so many uh, options are available you guys can enable that uh, gestures so you guys can check yourself and let me show you the settings and before I move on to the settings and I just want to clear one thing you guys the safety net is not passed by default but you guys can manually fix this easily because this is Android 10 and I have already made so many videos you guys can use basic integrity success uh, you guys can uh, success the basic integrity uh, easily just go to magix manager go to setting and you guys already know about that just enable magic side and reboot your device and your this one will be passed this one the basic integrity will be passed but cts profile uh, will be failed so if, if you want to see uh, pass the cts profile then uh, follow my video uh, link will be in description or you guys can check it on icard i'll give the provide the link so if you want to use banking application then you guys can easily use no problem and that's all the rom actually and here is the ages uh, you guys can see for performance uh, purpose you guys can use uh, that feature they have provided and we have that the music player phonograph so that's all guys uh, let me show you the settings so here is the settings uh, we have the uh, regular uh, features here available no problem if you guys want to use you guys can easily use and we have quality everything wifi calling uh, every necessary customizations features everything is available in that room you just can easily use no problem and we have the styles and wallpapers so many things are available uh, as we have all the custom rooms we have so this is gonna be the best custom room guys and you guys can watch the gameplay right now and if I miss anything just uh, don't forget to ask in the comment section below so guys before I uh, start playing uh, let me show you graphics settings and actually which our Redmi 7 supports low graphics quality and frame rate high you guys can choose and now let's start I will show you some gameplay so you guys can see the gameplay started
enemy is near so let me find him If you have a good battery charge, you can play more smoothly. So my suggestion would be uh, keep your charge uh, around more uh, more than 50%. Then you can play easily, no issue. And this is gonna be the best, best, best custom ROM for Redmi 7 to play games. If you love to play games, and if you want to play games in your Redmi 7, then you guys can go with that ROM with no issues. Uh, sometimes you can get some. Uh, frame drops, but this is not a major thing. So hope you guys understand the gameplay actually this is really cool you guys can play games easily on your redmi 7 if you guys want to play